y'all welcome back to my channel I'm Amy and if you are new here then welcome and if you're coming back thank you for watching um, today I'm going to be doing an organize with me with my dresser drawers my husband already did his drawers a few weeks ago because when I was cleaning out our closet he got motivated from watching me do that so he went ahead and did his own drawers himself because I wanted him to decide what he wanted to keep and what he wanted to donate so Today, you're going to get to see me go through my drawers. I'm going to sort by um, giveaway and I'm going to sort, and then the rest I'm going to keep. But I'm also going to change up how I fold my clothes so that I can um, get everything in the drawers so that I can see it better. I did this with my kids, my son's drawer, my son's closet and drawers, and then also my daughter's closet and drawers. And I'll link those videos down below in case you'd like to go look at those. But I will also, at the end of the video, show you guys how I'm folding my clothes. I was trying to do it the KonMari way, and it was just taking me way too long. And so, even though I really love the way she does it, I decided to just go ahead and fold my clothes the same way that I usually do. But instead of putting them in and stacking them, I'm using the filing system so that it, I do like that part of her method where you can see everything that you have and I realize that tons more will fit in the drawer and it will just be so much more organized. So I'll show you guys how I'm doing that at the end of the video. If you like these kinds of videos or if you wanna see more of these kinds of videos, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button right down below. And if you are not subscribed, click the subscribe button and if you want to make sure that you don't miss any more of my videos, then make sure you hit the little bell icon and it will notify you guys whenever I have a new video out. All right, so let's go ahead and jump right into this. All right, y'all, so the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is all my drawers and how much of a mess they are. They are, all my clothes are just kind of stacked on top of each other. I do have them organized by what goes in each drawer, but other than that, it's kind of a mess. So in the comments below, I want you guys to let me know how are your drawers, are they super organized or could they leave, need a little work or are they a teetotal mess like mine? Alright, so I'm going to be starting with my chest of drawers first and the first thing I'm going to do is just take everything out of the drawers. And any of the drawers that you see that I do not touch, those are my husband's. And like I said, he has already done his drawers first, so I don't even have to mess with those. Next, I'm going through everything and just deciding what I'm gonna keep and what I'm going to donate. Now I'm just vacuuming out all the drawers before I put everything back in. Alright, and here you're going to see me put everything back in the drawers and this is where I was talking about I use the filing method now so that everything stands up and you can see all of your clothes, every single piece that you have. And um, with the KonMari method, she says to kind of do it by color. And as you can see, I really did not do that. Um, I did it with my kids' drawers, but I did not do it with my own.
All right, now I'm moving on to my big dresser and just going through the same exact steps. So this didn't take me too long and I just love how it turned out. I love how organized everything is and I just, I'm so glad that I just decided to do this. All right, now that you have seen me kind of organize my drawers, I'm gonna show you how I'm folding each type of clothing. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is my t-shirts. So I always just fold them by holding it up I fold the, the sleeves in first, and then I fold it in half, and then I just kind of lay it out, and then I'm going to fold it kind of right past the center, and then fold it one more time so that it is like this. And so that way when I put it inside of the drawer, I just kind of file it in just like this. And once you have all of your stuff in the drawers, it is easier to keep it that way because then you just kind of, um, I kind of did mine by colors, which is what Kamari does. They do it from lightest to darkest. And you can be that organized or not, it's totally up to you. But um, once you have it in there, it is kind of easy just to kind of stick them back in the place where it goes. All right, and then I'm gonna show you how I do tank tops. So for my tank tops, I like to hold them upside down and then I fold them over so that it is like this. And then I will kind of fold it in half again. So I just kind of lay it down, fold it in half like this, and then fold it again. And then you could even fold it twice if you wanted to. My drawers are kind of big, so I just kind of keep it like that. And then for my workout shorts and regular shorts, I literally just fold them like this and then fold them in half and then they go in the drawer this way. And then for my workout pants, I fold them in half and then you can do the same thing with jeans. Lay them out and then I like to do the bottom part up first and I kind of fold them not quite to the end, if you can see. And then I'll fold them where the end of that was and then fold it one more time and then they just go in the drawer like this. All right, I hope that that was helpful. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye y'all.